trying to make it seem like he was hard. He don't had enough too, just like his wife. Enough is enough. Blood cleat. So listen, all right. I think I posted that about Sweetie already. Let's move on to his wifey, Cardi B. Cardi B is going through it. She's going through it. You want to know why? Because things ain't been the same since she dropped like what? You know, I believe that Cardi thinks that the same things that apply from yesteryear. Ooh, you know what? I have to think of a perfect words, perfect way to put this into words because this is how I truly feel. Cardi B sees what's going on with Quavo, Chris Brown, even though she's on the side of the losers, right? She sees what's going on with Quavo. And then, you know, um, she's seen what happened with Megan Thee Stallion and Hiss and how Megan got a huge boost off of that. Cardi B, the tricks of yesteryear are over. You will never eat off Nicki name no more. You got a lot of clout back then because you manipulated the industry and also the media to make it think, make it seem as though that Nicki was jealous of you. You're not even talented. You're not talented. And the tricks of yesteryear are over. I know you want somebody to get out there and go and, and go into you out here in the club singing songs that came out five weeks ago. Ain't nobody repeating. It. You really know you did. You know you did. It. Ain't nobody jacking it. Trying to do this little these little dance. Like, remember that dance she tried to create with Grow Glorilla? She thought that people was gonna be doing some dance to her song. They're not doing the blood dance. Talk to talk, walk the walk, dance the dance, and do what they can. Listen, this is an art. Listen, I've made my mark. And ain't no flow without fire. Then I am the spark. Fire, flames. <gasps> Listen, so anyway, I want to show you this about Cardi B. This is really sad out here. So somebody said when Nikki announced her tour, oh, Eritron, Ari, 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 he said when Nikki announced her tour, they were talking all types. They were making all types of collages saying that the dates were not sold out. She has currently sold out every show that she's been on so far about how many dates she performed, like 27. Um, she has currently sold out every day so far, but it's quiet for them mentioning five number ones, Grammy award winning rapper show for the BET award experience. So look at the BET award experience with all of those people on the headline. Look how many blood cleat tickets is available. You see them availability. You know that they're going to have to put them tickets on Klarna after paying. Listen, listen, listen. You know how she went up against Nikki, and I told y'all she was gonna get her karma. Now she got to deal with fans that got to face that after paying Klarna. Yeah, that after paying Klarna. Listen, I use after pay sometimes when I don't want to when I don't, when I get a big purchase and I don't want to pay it all at once. Not just be like, oh, I want this four hundred dollar cologne. So let me break this up in four payments because you know sometimes you just can't. Whatever reason, whatever. Shoot, I got like almost twenty five hundred dollars on Afterpay. So shoot, my credit good. You know what I'm saying? But um, Cardi B is just like her karma is Afterpay and Klarna because it's just like why is so many blue? You see all that blue? Blue, 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 blue. I am blue. Da 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 Blood clot blue. Come on, man. Come on. And she's sitting over there in the blue. Oh, so listen, let me go back over here. So Cardi, her whole, her whole world has been in a disarray ever since she dropped the like what freestyle, right? She's just been in a disarray. Things just ain't been the same, you know? We have to reiterate it in multiple videos just to let people know so, they're, so they stay the course and they understand what's going on. This song flopped. Enough flopped. The remix with Flo Millie flopped. I know Flo Millie thought that she finally got her big one. She like, you know what? I can't get nothing from Nikki because I'm so fake and running around saying Lil Wayne and Beyonce name. I'm so fake. Can't get Nikki. So guess what? I'm about to upgrade her with Cardi. And this song going to go number one. Guess what, sweetheart? You would have had a better chance going number one if you just kept SZA on the record. You had this girl on here. She's trying to cap. She capping her rap. And she's trying to tell everybody. She's trying to tell everybody that they was going viral on TikTok. Men will never be me, oh no. Men will never be me, oh no. Who's saying it? Because they ain't playing it. Who the blood saying it? They ain't playing it. Men will never be me in my life. Men will never be me in my life. Where they saying it at? Cardi wants beef with Nikki, but she she don't know how to do it. Onika is on tour. She's just, you know, she doing her thing. 
Cardi dropped multiple records. Cardi's plan was to drop all of these records to cause this frenzy on the Billboard Hot 100. And like Cardi came back, she got four songs out. This was supposed to help her deals because you know Nicki put us on and told us that whenever you come out, if your if your songs ain't bubbling, that means you get paid less money for your deals. Deals ain't gonna be dealing right. Um, she said that Megan Thee Stallion got that little uh, number one with Hiss, and she like, dang, she did enough for it, enough, and she tried to do all this. Then okay, okay. Okay. And, and it's like, it ain't work. You know, I just have to constantly point this out to you because what I want to say is, is that they thought that those games that they played years ago were going to work. And then now it's no longer going to work anymore. We're going to see who's been naughty and who's been nice. All right. We're going to see who's been naughty and who's been nice. And it's time to move on. Shout out to Nicki Minaj. I know all of y'all know by now that Nicki Minaj and um, is it Lochi or Losi? Her sneaker collaboration with the company that she is also owner of has sold out completely. Sold out completely. Sold out Minaj. Let me bring you over here just so you can see it. Is this a different color? I felt like these sneakers were white before. I felt like they was white. So let's click on this, right? Because before they had pre they had pre-orders up to July. So I guess all of the pre-orders sold out as well. So let's scroll down. Collection sold out. That's crazy. Look at Nikki, the boss that she is. The boss that she is. You know what I'm saying? Sold out Minaj. Sold out. I'm so happy for Nikki. So Nikki said, thank you very much. The slide gets better and better. You, It gets better and better as you go, I promise. So, yeah. What we up to? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27. And you know she's going to sell out Chicago. And you know she's going to sell out Chicago two times. And then she's going to go, yeah, Nikki, things are going Big, big, big twings. Are big things are going Organic fan things are going You know what I'm saying? So listen. I want y'all to get in the comments. Please let me know how you feel about anything that I discussed. Um, let me know how you feel about the Quavo and Chris Brown and how he tried to drag Rihanna in it and all of that, too. Let me know how you feel about that. Um, let me know how you feel about the Beyonce and her hair products. And what do you think she's teasing? Do you think that she's trying to say that the tour is coming or whatever? Let me know how you feel about that. Also, let me know what you think about Cardi B and that BET experience. And yeah, it's looking a little slow. It's looking a little slow, but you know what? I said that this universe has a way of getting you back. It has a way of getting you back. So listen, this is your boy, Laurent. Also, let me know, did you get sneakers from Nikki's collection? You know, which, what tour date did you go to already? If you've already been to the tour or what upcoming date are you going to? You know what I'm saying? So listen, this is your boy, Laurent, Potent Ponder. And please make sure that you subscribe to this channel. Please make sure that you also support the channel. The cash app is on the screen. Dollar sign Potent Pondering. Share the video, all of that. You know what I'm saying? And yeah, y'all be safe. I'm going to holla at y'all tomorrow for sure. I'm out.